Hey guys, so the main reason why iPhones and new Macs are so optimized and fluid is because they got their own software integrated with their in-house silicon. They know how software works and interacts with hardware to provide the best experience. CIOS plus A14 Bionic is like the best combination. We saw macOS Big Sur plus M1 chip destroying Intel i7 and i9 in terms of the benchmarks and performance. So a yeah, point is in-house chip plus own software allows brands to unleash the full potential. Now breaking news is Google is working with Samsung for their in-house CPU. They are calling it White Chapel. This report is confirmed by Korean media and also by news publication XIOS. They say Google has joined hands with Samsung for a 5 nanometer chipset. They say Google is likely gonna use it in next year's Pixel devices which we all know is the Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 XL. This will not only allow Google to compete against A14 Bionic but also Samsung's Exynos CPU for next year. Yeah, another main thing is pricing. This year's Qualcomm 865 flagship CPU was expensive and that was the main reason we saw hike in phone price. So Google using their own CPU is of course going to cost less than buying Qualcomm CPU. XIOS says in addition to 8 core CPU, Whitechapel will also include hardware optimization for Google's machine learning technology. So again as I said, Google can unleash the full potential of their smartphone by modifying the software and hardware accordingly. You know Google used Chidanium M chipset for security, they use Pixel Visual Core for image processing and you guys know how amazing their image processing is. So if Google combines their software with their own silicon, they can do wonders for sure. XIOS says a portion of their silicon will also be dedicated to improve the performance and always on functioning of Google Assistant. Last year at Google I.O. we heard Google is trying their best to fully integrate Google Assistant. So this is their next move in this AI thing. Google Assistant is already way ahead in comparison to others. But to make their phone fully AI like for Assistant to control each and everything, they need something big. And I think Whitechapel is the one they are gonna utilize. So the Pixel 6 and Pixel 6 XL likely coming with Google's own CPU. Never been so excited about upcoming flagship. Samsung got this powerful Exynos 2100. OnePlus working on this Mariana project and now Google. So your thoughts in the comment section and I'll meet you guys in the next one. Peace out.